Hey y'all, it's Katie. I'm gonna show you a really simple um, meal. It's just beef stew, it's really simple. I don't know why I keep saying it's really simple. You need any kind of vegetables you want. I have got baby carrots, which I'm still going to cut a little smaller because Tom won't eat them if they're cooked. I have some potatoes, which I have peeled, and I'm gonna dice them bad boys up. I have some onion, and I have some beef stew meat. Can be any kind of meat you want, but since it's beef stew, and I got this guy today. They had regular kind. They have pot roast. It's not a pot roast, it's a beef stew. And I got this because I couldn't find on Pinterest any recipe because I didn't want to go get this because I already had all this stuff. And I was like, man, but I couldn't find anything that I actually had the ingredients for. And this was a dollar something, no big deal. Um, so I'm gonna show you how I make beef stew. Simple, one, two, three, and vegetables, four ingredients. So let's take a beef stew journey. Like I said, this is my bag of potatoes. It doesn't matter what kind of potatoes you get. I can use red, I can use yellow. That's just what I had on hand. I peeled them. You don't have to, but you need to wash them really well. I've got four to start with. I might add another one. I have my onion. It's, I always keep, you know, in tin foil so it doesn't stink. Have some meat. I bought it out last night. No big deal. Got some carrots that I'm gonna cut. And that. Okay, this is what the beef stew mix looks like whenever you add water to it, which is what you're supposed to do. And you mix it together. So I did that. And I have my veggies chopped. I have a little bit of onion. I may add some more added the carrots and the potatoes. So I'm gonna put, I think I'm gonna put all of this in first and then put the meat over it because you have to stir it around anyway. Um, so, and then I'm gonna add the meat and then I'm gonna put the seasoning on top of it. Okay, so here we go. I'm gonna put all the veggies in. Now you can add celery if you wanted to. You could add, some people add peas. Um, I mean, it's whatever you want to do. It's not like, oh, there's only one beef stew. This is just something easy and quick that I'm making for my family that can, you know, feed all of us. Come on, potato. So I have that in there. Actually, I think I'm good with the onion. Ooh, that sounded bad. Okay, so you can see this. Just dropped an onion on my toe. And I'm going to flick meat in you don't have to season it I mean if you wanted to brown it I know some folks um, like to you know go in the frying pan and brown it to give it a little color that's it's not necessary that's just like an added step you don't have to do it I just got a hunk of stew meat on my counter Ew. I hate raw meat it's like the grossest so that's in and then I'm going to give an extra little stir to my stew mix, gravy mix. I don't know what would you call this, gravy mix? Just pour all that goodness over it. And the instructions say, you know, stir to coat, whatever. So it didn't really matter what you put in, like your vegetables or your stuff. But that's what I'm gonna do right now and that's it and you have a an easy dinner that will cook all day and it takes a few minutes to put together I also got some bread from Walmart 50 cents I like 50 cents bread and that's what we're gonna have for dinner I keep wanting to look over here instead of right here still have party cleaning up to do but this is your stuff and I will talk to you guys later all right, you guys, it is 2.40. I don't even remember what time it was when I put this on. I know it was a little after eight. So we're gonna check it out. It smells really good. She's looking yummy. She's also killing my crock pot. <laughs> 
I think this is gonna be super yummy with some buttered bread. Um, look at that. You got a nice thickish sauce. It's gonna be great. And the best part, you can use the leftovers and make a shepherd's pie, which is a super easy thing to do. But that's what we got so far. I will let you know what it looks like later. All right, y'all, there she is. Beef stew, put a little bit of pepper, got some of my buttered bread, and that is it.